Hi everybody, uh, my name is Matt DeQuina, I'm a 2008 Beijing Judo Olympian and founder and owner of BeyondGrappling.com. Today my friend Mohan and I are going to go over how to know what throw to do against your opponent. You know, I have so many people email me every day, I get emails every day, so keep sending them, I like them, I'll try to get to them when I can, I would reply to mo a lot of them, but I, there's a lot. So anyway, uh, and uh, people say, I can't throw anybody, okay, I can't throw anybody, so this is just going to be a video to help you throw more people, pretty much. Now this is what it is, and it's, it's, you've got to twitch, you twitch, you do stuff to see what your opponent responds, what they do, and then you, let me start that again. So, I'm just going to show you. So I'm fighting Mohan, right? Now what I want to do is I twitch. So I twitch to get a reaction from him. And from that reaction, it will tell me what throw to do. For example, we're fighting my hand and, and I, I, I twitch forward and he's going to give me a reaction. Okay, so he sat his weight back and his right foot's forward. Then we keep fighting and I go, that's awesome. When I twitched, he put his right foot forward and he leant backwards, which gives me two options. If that right foot's forward, I can do a no gary and I can do a Kawachigari, right? So, this might be this might be what happened, ready? Hi Jimmy, we come out, we're fighting for grips, we're fighting like in competition, and then I go like this, okay? And at the moment he's jigger tight, so he's kind of square, which means I can do, and he's kind of going backwards, I can do anything. So then what happens, we keep fighting, and I twitch again, and he'll probably give me the same reaction. And when he does, Kawachigari, okay? And I get a score maybe. We keep fighting, we keep fighting. Maybe I've got a top grip this time. And maybe this time I, 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 I give an Osotogari reaction. I go, and he might give me a reaction. And from that reaction will dictate what to do next, okay? Now most of the time a reaction, your partner will do a few things. This is at a very basic level, okay? But it's gonna help you understand what to do. If your partner reacts, if I just twitch, for example, and go square, I twitch and then you give me a reaction, either left or right forward, foot forward. So if I go like this, he does right foot forward. Now the next time I do that, I go for the Kawachi straight away. Or I go for a Soto straight away. Maybe when I twitched, his left foot came forward. Okay, we keep fighting, we keep fighting. I twitch, I want you go. Right, because he's giving me that. So rather than just going for throws, start going for tw uh, twitching for throws and your partner will give you a particular reaction. And then from that reaction, you know what to do next. Okay, so if it's their right foot comes forward, you've got Osoto, uh, oh, Kawuchi, you've got left Owuchi if you want, okay? If his left foot comes forward, I've got an Owuchi, I've got a Kosoto, I can do like a crazy left Osoto, or whatever, but it, he's giving me something. Rather than looking for throws, I've got to look at what he's giving me, and then I can choose accordingly. But on the flip side of that, I also need to make throws happen. But this is just a really easy way for the, the lower level belts to find out how to throw somebody. And you can twitch by doing a few things. You can face forward, and it's a short, sharp movement. I'm not using strength. I can twitch with my feet, or I can stand the feet. I can twitch like that, I can twitch with my arms, I can twitch with my gear, I can twitch with my head, but all these things give you a reaction. Most of the time when I twitch this way, my partner will react the other way, which will give me, and look how low I am, this will give me different techniques to work on. So I really encourage you to do that, start twitching and going one way, and that will super duper help you be able to throw more people, because you're getting your partner to react for you, and then whatever reaction they give you, left or right, or jigger tie, you can then throw them because they're giving you a throw. So I really hope that helped you guys. Helped you guys. If you have any questions, please write them in the box below. Uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. I've got about 400 videos here on YouTube and I always like up uploading more. If you want more coaching from me, make sure you head to the universityofjudo.com and, uh, and sign up there for my, for my site when it goes live. So have a great week. Talk to you later on.